Chow Chow Top 10 Facts The Chow Chow dog breed has a proud, independent personality with an eye-catching look that some compare to a cat's. If you are looking for a cuddle buddy, this isn't the breed for you. They can be aloof and afraid of strangers. For the right person, they can, however, be a fiercely loyal partner. Do you consider purchasing a Chow Chow? In this video, you will learn everything about the breed based on 8 topics, so you can find out if this dog is best for you. Number 1. Origin Fact 1. One of the most ancient dog breeds The Chow Chow has long been thought to be one of the most ancient dog breeds, and genetic testing has confirmed this. The ancient breed is believed to have originated in Mongolia and northern China, then moved south with Mongolia's nomadic tribes. Pottery and paintings from the Han Dynasty include early depictions of dogs that resemble the Chow Chow 206 BC to 22 AD. One Chinese emperor is said to have kept 2500 pairs of Chows as hunting dogs. In addition to hunting, the dogs were used to protect their owner's belongings. Fact 2. The name Chow Chow In China, the breed was known as the Black Tongue Dog Hei Shei To, Wolf Dog Lang Gao, Bear Dog Xiang Gao, and Canton Dog Guangdong Gao. The tale of how he came to be known as the Chow Chow is interesting. In the late 18th century, British merchants included some of the bear-like dogs in their cargo. The name Chow Chow was given to a variety of species, including dogs, and it stuck. Number 2. Personality Fact 3. Strangers are uninteresting to them. Chow Chow's personality has been defined as reserved, independent, dignified, intelligent, and stubborn, similar to that of a cat. Despite his scowl, a healthy Chow should never be rude or shy. Chows are usually quiet and don't get into mischief. Strangers are uninteresting to them unless they enter the Chow's home without permission, in which case the trespasser will be confronted. Strangers, on the other hand, would be able to reach him if one of his owners introduces them to him. If a Chow Chow is to be safe and relaxed as an adult, he must be thoroughly socialized as a child, which includes exposure to new people pets and situations. Number 3. Appearance Fact 4. An impressive looking breed With deep set eyes and a big head accentuated by a mane of fur, the Chow Chow, Chow for short, is an impressive looking breed. Because of his appearance, you might think a well-bred and well-raised Chow is mean or ill-tempered. But a well-bred and well-raised Chow isn't aggressive. Instead, the Chow is said to have the nobility of a lion, the drollness of a panda, and the appeal of a teddy bear, the grace and independence of a cat, and the loyalty and devotion of a dog. He's still dignified and aloof, as befits a breed that was once kept in imperial Chinese kennels. Number 4. Trainability Fact 5. Never hit this dog while training. A quick verbal correction is normally enough to get the Chow Chow back on track when it comes to training. It's never a good idea to hit a dog, but it's especially bad with this breed. Chow, who is fiercely self-reliant and proud, will never respond violently. You'll have no trouble teaching him if you gain his confidence by being consistent. While Chows are reasonably easy to housebreak, crate training is highly recommended. Crates aid in house training and deter your Chow from chewing on your personal items while you're away. However, a crate is a weapon, not a cage, so don't keep your Chow in it for long periods of time. Fact 6. Capable of understanding everything you can tell them. The safest place to get a Chow is right next to you. Chows are more than capable of understanding everything you can tell them. And typically, only a verbal connection is needed to correct them. You won't have any trouble teaching him if you gain his confidence as a puppy by being strict and consistent. However, if you let the adorable puppy have his way all of the time and then try to teach him, you are bound to have issues. Number 5. Time Investment Fact 7. 
Chow Chows shed a lot in the spring and summer. To keep the coat in good condition and prevent loose hair from falling on your clothes and furniture, clean your Chow Chow three times a week. Since Chow Chows shed a lot in the spring and in the summer, they need special grooming. The fur does not have a doggy odor if it is cleaned on a daily basis. Brushing includes a medium coarse toothed stainless steel greyhound comb, a medium sized slicker brush for the legs, a medium pin brush for the longer body hair, and a spray bottle of diluted coat conditioner for misting the coat while brushing. The hair in a dry coat will break if it is brushed. You'll miss mats and tangles if you don't clean all the way down to the skin. Number 6. Best Home Fact 8. They are happy with opposite gender dogs. If raised with children, Chow Chows will get along with them. But they are not rough and tumble dogs who will put up with a lot of teasing from a young child. Chows excel in families with older children who are familiar with dog treatment. To prevent biting or ear pulling on either hand, teach children how to approach and touch your chow and supervise all interactions between dogs and young children. Chows that have been properly socialized and trained get along with other dogs and cats, particularly if they are introduced to them as puppies. They are more effective when working with dogs of the opposite gender, but they can also fight with dogs of the same gender. Number 7. Health Fact 9 may develop diseases in the early two years. Chow Chows are usually healthy dogs, but they, like all breeds, can develop health problems. While not all Chows will contract any or all of these illnesses, it is important to be aware of them if you're thinking about getting one. Find a successful breeder who can show you health clearances for both your puppy's parents if you're buying a puppy. Health clearances demonstrate that a dog that has been screened for and cleared of a specific disease. Health clearances from the Orthopedic Foundation for Animals and for Hips and the Canine Eye Registry Foundation serve certifying that the eyes are natural should be used in Chows. Health clearances are not provided to dogs younger than two years old because certain health issues do not turn up until they reach the full maturity. Look for a breeder who waits until the dogs are two or three years old before breeding them. Number 8. Cost Fact 10. Chow Chow has expenses The dog is expensive to buy, but the expenses of keeping a Chow Chow don't stop there. It'll cost you about $900 to get your own Chow Chow. The medium dog's average grooming expense is $90. Chow Chows have a lifespan of 12 to 15 years, with annual healthcare cost of $11,000. Did you like this video? If so, it would be great if you subscribe to our channel so you do not miss new videos and learn more about dogs every day. And if you are interested in dog braid training and training methods, you should also check out the description. Thank you so much for watching.